to Soho Trent and the world. This is Six Towns Radio. Chills Bar, Baisley, sponsors of Port Vale content on Six Towns Radio. Okay, Louis Dodds, great win at Corley on Tuesday night. Um, a good start for you as well. Yeah, absolutely. Um, I think we started off uh, fast and furious, and I think it was nice to get the goal to steady us. And like you say, it was um, almost a perfect night um, with the performance and the clean sheet. So I'm delighted with it. Yeah, you go to Crawley, uh, especially on the results they've been having, thinking, oh, we might not get something from here, but they proved everyone wrong. Absolutely. I think. Um, there were a few people kicking themselves, putting Crawley on the coupon. I think we uh, we messed up a few of them. So. I think no, no one really gave us that much of a chance, but we went there positive and like I say, it's amazing what you can do when you're, you're positive and you've got a lot of work weight and uh, we've got a great result. Got another good start and started with a goal. Um, important to cement your place in the first team again? Absolutely. I think uh, when you get given the chance, you need to, um, I say, put markers down on, on performance and um, I think I did that. I worked hard and obviously got my goal, so hopefully I get the nod again and have to do it all over again. Yeah, debut for Jordan Hugill. Uh, is that what you say? It's Huggle. Huggle. Great game for him as well as assists for him. Absolutely, it was um, fantastic. We made him um, sing his song in the in the hotel, and um, he was confident then, so you could tell he was going to have a, a good night. And it was um, it was fantastic and unlucky not to score himself. Yeah, and Popey on the bench, actual rest for him for a bit. Yeah, um, <laughs> I, yeah I, th- I think he'd be the first to tell you that sometimes yeah, you need that as a striker because uh, you just need to find yourself and find your form and. Um, Luckily, Jordan's come in with Ben and shown what they can do. So, um, yeah, it's a, it's a nice uh, option for the Gaff to have now. Shows you what a roller coaster the season is. You went to Sheffield United on Saturday. Again, they're not having a great time of it, but Vale couldn't get a, a point there. And then you go to Crawley, mm-hmm. not expecting maybe, well, a lot of people weren't, and mm-hmm. you, you take it. So, yeah, uh, I think Vale lie at the moment. I know it's early doors, but five points off fifth or something right, like that. Yeah, it's, it's, a, it's a mad league, and uh, I think if you get one or two results, you can absolutely rock up the table so um, so each game as it comes really yeah Gillingham Saturday um, of course came up with Port Vale as champions in League 2 um, so a team you'll know some of the players etc they've lost the manager Martin Allen being one mm-hmm. of the first casualties of the season um, again the team who haven't got a manager mm-hmm. um, run a bad result yeah. <laughs> a bit more pressure on your back I think yeah I think so um, I think we've not got to take anything for granted they've got a caretaker manager but he's his mind's at international level so um, he'll, have, he'll have them doing what he wants them to do and uh, I think it'll be a good game and hopefully we go there with our confidence from the other night and we carry on from where we left Thank you very much Super